hey guys so this video is going to be in English only because I wanted to start with some English tutorials on my channel and I'm gonna start off by using my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer all over my lids I'm gonna blend it with my Flawless Beauty Sponge from Morphe and then I'm gonna use the Morphe 35F palette but first I'm gonna set my eyeshadow with some powder and then I'm gonna go with this transition shade in my crease so as you can see I'm taking a blending brush and I'm blend blending it all over my crease and then I'm taking a little warmer shade that's more to the brown and I'm adding it towards the outer V and the inner corners of my eyes to create a smoky look and then with the same blending brush I'm blending it all in as you can see I'm keeping the center kind of empty because I want to add the glitter later on and then I'm smoking it out a little more towards the outer V I'm taking this silverish grayish kind of shade and I'm applying it over the inner and outer corner as well and then I'm taking another flat brush to like blend it a little more because it had fix plus on it the other one so this one has no fix plus it blends more then I'm taking the brown eyeshadow a dark brown eyeshadow actually the same one that I used uh, before and I'm blending the gray eyeshadow more towards the crease now I'm taking this rosy golden kind of shade and, up, and, I'm up, and I'm applying it in the center to give kind of like a pop of color for that look and I'm taking my brush again and blending. Next I'm gonna take, take my black eyeshadow from the palette and I'm just gonna put the black towards the outer V to give like a, like a lift to my eyes and I'm taking the nude uh, glittery shadow, the white one and I'm placing it under the brows and in the center in, in the center of the lids then I'm taking my brush with the rose gold eyeshadow just to blend that out and then I'm taking my eyeliner from L'Oreal my gel liner and with the brush that it comes with I'm drawing my wing next I'm cleaning my makeup with the makeup wipes and I'm placing a little bit of concealer under my uh, eyes then I'm gonna take the black and brown shadows and mixing them together to like smoke out my bottom lash line I'm first placing them right along my lower lash line and then I'm gonna take a pencil brush to blend the brown to give it like a smoky effect I'm smoking out this look a lot on the lower lash line because I want it to look like, like very smoky. Then I'm taking the glitter and placing it all over it and with my Urban Decay Black Coal Pan I'm placing it on my waterline for a more smoky feel. I want this look to be very smoky and then I'm taking my pencil brush again blending and now I'm doing my brows with the brow is by Anastasia Beverly Hills some of you are loving the brow definer recently but personally I don't really like it I prefer the brow is more because I felt like it was more precise for my type of brows maybe so as you can see I'm lining my brows from the bottom first and then I'm lining them from the top everyone does their brows differently so I'm not gonna go really in depth for this Next, I'm taking my Urban Decay Perversion Mascara, placing it all over my lashes. And then I'm taking my Lily Lashes in the style Mykonos. Everything is really dramatic in this look. I know I want something extremely dramatic for this New Year's Eve look. Then I'm taking my Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk and my Strobing Cream from uh, MAC. And I'm mixing them together and placing it with my Flawless Beauty Sponge all over my face. I love this foundation so much. Also, this strobing cream is like boss. I always have like a lot of struggle putting uh, foundation on my forehead. Now I'm taking my uh, Pro Longwear Concealer again and I'm highlighting under my, uh, along my uh, dark circles, under my nose, on my nose, on my chin, <laughs> on my chin first. And then on my nose and on my uh, between my brows and on my forehead just a little bit. Blending it again. Now I'm blending it uh, more towards my uh, lower lash line. 
Then I'm gonna take this contour stick from MAC and I'm gonna contour my face, obviously. And I'm starting off with my cheekbones, my forehead, my nose, and a little bit on my chin. And I'm blend blending it in dabbing motions as well. I'm gonna take my Laura Mercier powder and bake under my eyes. I don't know why I've been loving baking recently. I never used to like it, but recently I've been really loving this technique. I have no clue why. I'm gonna take my MAC Give Me Sun bronzer and I'm gonna bronze up my cheekbones and my forehead a little bit. Then I'm gonna take Rapture by Urban Decay. It's a really beautiful pinky blush and I'm gonna apply it to my cheekbones for a little pop of color there. Then I'm gonna swipe away the baking. I'm gonna apply mascara on my bottom lash line. Excuse that little dot of mascara. I wipe it away right now. Wait. Okay, it's gone. Now I'm gonna take this uh, highlighter by MAC and it's from the new strobing collection. I forgot what it's called. I'll write it in the description bar. And with this Morphe fan brush, I'm gonna apply it on my cheeks, my cupid's bow, my nose, my chin, and above the arch of my brows. Now I'm gonna take Madison from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm gonna line up my lips with it using a brush and then I'm gonna fill it all in using the applicator from the lipstick. I'm really sorry if I'm like kind of not knowing what to say because I'm not really used to speaking all English so I'm kind of still practicing at the moment. I'm gonna take the applicator now and line and fill in my lips. And I guess that's it for this look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys like me talking in English. I don't know. I just felt like doing a little change to my channel. And now I'm wrapping a belt as a choker on my neck. <laughs> it's like a new trend I've been loving. And that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. And if you recreate it for New Year's Eve, please tag me so I can see them. Love you all so much. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye bye. Mwah.